So the holidays are coming up, and there's one thing that seems to happen that gets some people into trouble when Thanksgiving rolls around. We're talking about deep frying a turkey. I'm sure you've seen the YouTube videos, so we're here at the Richmond Fire Department today where we talked to PIO Corey Lewis about what not to do and did a demonstration of just that. Get everything you want, when you want it, and where you want it on any mobile or digital device and viewable screen, including that big screen in your living room. Get it on the go, at night, or wherever you want it, 24-7, WBONTV.com. Learn it, love it, use it. So the holidays are coming up, and there's one mistake that we see a lot. We see YouTube videos of it, and we kind of did that here today. Tell us all about it, Corey. Yeah, Marissa, well, one of the things that we see around the holidays, especially Thanksgiving, uh, you know, cooking is the leading cause of home fires in our nation, and the single busiest day for fire departments across our nation is Thanksgiving when it comes to terms in relation to cooking fires. So we gave you a demonstration today of how not to deep fry a turkey. We did not have a thermometer, so we didn't, we overheated the oil. We didn't take into account the displacement for the turkey in the oil. And one of the things that we didn't do today was we didn't thaw out our turkey. All very important things to do when you're thinking about deep frying a turkey, which has become very popular uh, in our nation over the past couple years, well, the past several years. And so we wanna make sure that people understand that although it seems fairly easy to take into account some very safety-minded precautions before you do that. Always have a thawed turkey. Always make sure that you have enough oil and don't overfill your vessel uh, and put too much oil in. Make sure you have a thermometer so that you can maintain the appropriate temperature and make sure that you have a fire extinguisher on hand if you choose to do this uh, at your home and make sure you do it at the proper location. A deck is not the appropriate location to deep fry a turkey for Thanksgiving. So we saw quite a bit of flames today. How did we achieve that? What did we do wrong? Yeah, so we went over um, today about the not to, the not, how not to do this uh, at your house. And we had a frozen turkey that we didn't thaw out. We overfilled the pot with oil and we superheated that oil to the point where it was smoking prior to us dr just plopping the turkey down in there and not gradually accounting for putting that turkey down in the oil. I think standing by and paying attention to what you're doing, we know that across our country that the leading cause of home fires is cooking. And I think that's a leading cause of that is inattentiveness. Not leaving, not multitasking, but really paying attention to what you're doing in the kitchen is really the appropriate thing to do. If you do have some type of cooking fire in your house, call the fire department. Always err on the side of caution. We would much rather come out, uh, bring some really uh, neat pieces of technology, thermal imaging cameras. We can look behind walls for hidden fire. We can, um, without tearing the kitchen apart, be able to give you peace of mind that yes, you had a little fire, it was out, you did the appropriate things. Um, we can just double check that for you. And it's I always, always say, it's always better to be safe than sorry. So don't hesitate to call the fire department in the event of any type of small fire that you think, well, I had it out, I think we're good. Give us a call, we'd love to come out and check it and ensure that you are safe and that you did do things appropriately. So the Richmond Fire Department does not care to stop eating their turkey to come out and help in the event of a fire. Might be some grumblings on Thanksgiving, but that is what we get paid to do. Um, we would love to come out and help you out, you know, in a small emergency as opposed to you think you got it out and a couple hours later we have a large scale home fire that was hidden behind the walls because you didn't call and you thought you had it out. So yeah, we would much rather come out and be rather be safe than sorry. So you heard it here first. The Richmond Fire Department does not care to come out and help you if there's a fire this holiday season, even if they're eating their own turkey. For WBON-TV here at the Richmond Fire Training Center, I'm Marissa Hempel.